Ah, uh, where's me gold? Where's me gold? Where's me gold? Corned beef and cabbage. I just made it tonight. Succulent. Thick slices of corned beef and cabbage. Red skin potato with uh, Himalayan pink salt on it. My car was buried after the uh, the blizzard, uh, the nor'easter of 2017. My car was stuck on St. Patrick's Day, so I did not uh, leave the house to um, take part in, in the festivities uh, in a timely fashion. Better late than never. I made it tonight, today rather. Uh, corned beef brisket, like I said, Red skin potato, uh, cabbage, and uh, Himalayan pink salt. As you can see, the Himalayan pink salt on the potato, and uh, I put it on the cabbage because I, I don't eat I don't use regular salt. Regular salt is for brain dead imbeciles. I use the best, high super nutrition. And speaking of using the best high super nutrition, I give a shout out to. The creator himself, Mario Petrus, and I also give a shout out to uh, Glenn Bean of Wisconsin. Uh, so I hope you you can really see this work of art, this Irish American work of art in high definition splendor. Corned beef and cabbage. Corned beef, brisket, and cabbage. Very succulent, very tender. Better late than never. This is James P. Madonna of the Facebook group, Everything is Food. Signing off. Because now I will gorge myself. All you cheap bastards that own restaurants that stopped the all-you-can-eat Corned beef and cabbage. You can go fuck yourselves. And also the restaurants that stop the all-you-can-eat baby back barbecued ribs. Maybe because it's my fault. Can also go fuck yourselves.